Hello, Cancer. Welcome back to New Hope Tarot, where we will be doing your reading for the second half of May. I've meditated upon the cards and I have pre shuffled. As always, I will shuffle live during meditation. Spirit showed me an upside down A. Uh, before I tell you what that means, uh, Spirit gave me, well, the energies, I should say, the energies that I connected with um, were there is something that is going on or has gone on or will go on. I'm not sure. It feels like there's something that you're curious about that may have caused some sort of ignition within you and it feels like whatever hesitation there was or will be will be cleared all right or has been cleared whatever timeline you're on I don't know um but you'll you'll know your okay you'll know your story all right uh, some of you don't want some sort of change um, so take that how it resonates, but as far as the, as far as the upside down A, I got the fact that something is set. I'm not sure what that means. It, it, it's like, it, it's an unstoppable thing, whatever that looks like. Something is set. There's a predictability to whatever whatever this is okay there's some sort of predictability i don't know what that means for you but i mean again you'll know your story right so let's get these cards up and going and read what we got going on here we have the page of swords which is the princess of swords four of cups in reverse ten of wands in reverse, nine of cups, the fool, eight of pentacles in reverse, three of wands in reverse, hangman, high priestess, or high priest, um, hierophant in reverse. And then we have temperance, the fearlet, at the bottom of the deck. Yeah, it feels here like you're trying to figure something out. It's like you're wanting to make this rainbow happen, but the rainbow's already there. It's like you're trying to create. Okay, so a couple of different stories are coming to mind. Some of you are trying to create some sort of additional hesitation. Like it's almost like you're overthinking something. You're like, oh, I'm overly focused on this, but the just enjoy the joy right now. Why are we inside in this, whatever this is, why are we inside instead of being outside and enjoying the moment? I, again, we're overthinking something. We're over complicating something, overly focused on some sort of aspect when the thing is already happening the joy, the happiness is happening. Just freaking enjoy the moment. Enjoy the moment. Stop freaking causing extra conflictions for no reason. Even with the four of wands in reverse down here, like, like the celebration is happening. Why are we avoiding it? Why are we avoiding the celebration? Okay. Something is yours. Whatever that curious thing that a like you're like, ooh, like what is that? It's in your hands. But it feels like you're overly pondering it. I mean, it's right here right? It's here. You're holding it. It's here. It's readily available for you. 
but you're focused on something else. I don't know what that is. You know, with this 10 of wands in reverse, it's like you're, if, <laughs> it feels like you're nearing some sort of cycle, the end of some sort of cycle, but it feels like all you have to do, I mean, you really don't have that many burdens. Look at these, look at this 10 of wands. Can you, uh, can we get clear? There it is. Do you see the ten of the the sticks? Look how light that looks. But he's all hunched over because of all the extra burdens that he actually had previously, right? But but he's so used to being hunched over that he's like, oh wait, I can actually stand. Oh, I, I can stand. The path is laid right there in front of me. All I have to do is lay down these few sticks because my load has been lightened, but I'm still hunched over like I'm carrying all of this extra weight. The path is right there. Let's put these few sticks down. The, the residual um, sticks that were there, and let me just stand up and walk walk towards that thing because the path is right there. I mean, look, the mountains were right there. Look, you're, you're right there. You're at the tippy top. You're at that mountain. Actually, you're not even at the tippy top. I'm lying to you. It feels like you're like right here. It, 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 as far as perspective is concerned, like you're at the base of the mountain. All you have to go is walk towards that path to get to that rainbow. But it feels like in your mind, you're still in this dark area trying to figure things out. Oh, if I do this, if I do that, if I do this, but really you don't have to do anything. You just need to put those things down and go towards it. The end. That celebration is here. Your nine of cups, that dream is here. Look, here's the cup. It's in your hands. That's what I said here. It's in your hands, but you're kind of going, Oh, should I be celebrating it? I'm just going to sit over here. Why? Like, I don't understand why, why, what's going on? Like the journey is here. Here it is. There's that path. But it feels like you may be afraid of stepping off the cliff. You're like, eh, it feels too good. This may feel too good. So eh, I may not. But I feel like you just need to trust. There's plenty of people that are around you that are loyal to you. You may not feel it because it may feel like it may be few and far between people that are there, you know, like this dog. Normally it's a white dog, right? So perhaps what this, these people look like are not what you're used to, right? Um, it, all, it, it can also be where you've been bit by, you know, other dogs and you're like, well, do I trust this? And it feels like not only are you surrounded by at least one or two solid, good people in your life, it feels like you're also guided. Stop overthinking things. I mean, really, this Eight of Pentacles in reverse. Stop overthinking things. Stop overcomplicating. You already have all of the tools and knowledge that you need. You just need to start get going. You you just need to start get going on whatever the heck this is because it feels like, look, it's right there. It's within your grasp with this Three of Wands. And you're like, do I expand? Yes. Again, here it is. Overthinking with the hangman. You're, time, you're binding yourself up to something that you don't need to be bound to. You're able to free yourself. The sickle is right there. 
or at the bare minimum, because see, it feels like you're, you really are, it feels like you're, I'll get a clarifier, but it feels like you're able to free yourself, or at least you have others that are around you that are able to unbind you from whatever this is. You just have to trust. There's something, there's, it feels like you have faith, but there's, there's something that's keeping you from trusting completely. But spirituality is all around you. So I don't, the hermit, go within. That, that came out separate. Go within. You know the answers. All the answers are there. Go within. Okay. What do I, uh, uh, why? Okay. Nine of cups. I want a quick clarifier for this nine of cups here. What? Justice in reverse, five of swords. Yeah, you're, you're worried. Mm. You're worried that things won't pan out. So you're afraid of celebrating too soon in whatever this situation is. Okay. Okay. Let's talk about this fool. Wow, that was fast. Nine of swords. You're worried. You're worried to take on this new journey and that it may end up like the previous things. But look, here comes the white dove and it's squatting all, or not squatting, like um, squawking at the, at all of these blackbirds. Like, no, push out all the negativity. There's that glimmer of hope that, um, remember I was talking about the energy that I got, that uh, whatever hesitation was there, all this negative thoughts or, or hesitation, whatever those thoughts are, it's being cleared. There's that white bird. It's, it's being cleared. Like literally what I said at the very beginning, it's being cleared and just enjoy the moment. All right, why, why, why the hangman? Like, what's going on here? King of Cups. Oh, you're feeling too much. Okay. Can I have another card? You're feeling too much. You know it's right there, but you're feeling too much. It's almost like, okay. You know the abundance is there. You know that the relationship is there. Whatever this is for you. But it's almost like you're taking your sweet time to make sure that this will work out. Because you've been... Yay. Yeah, you're balancing things out. You're merging two things together but you're doing it cautiously. Yeah. It's almost like you, you have to settle yourself before you move towards whatever this, that feels good. Remember that thing that you're curious about that caused some sort of ignition that, uh, that has that gave you some sort of like, it's almost like it gave you some sort of power boost, like in a good way, like, like an emotional boost, like, like a good sort of thing. Yeah. Okay. This, okay. This makes sense. This makes sense. Okay. Okay. All right. Let's get some advice. Yeah. All right, advice. All right, advice, advice, or cancer. Ooh, sorry.
celebrate the small wins. Nine of Cups and Eight of Cups in reverse, Five of Cups and the world. Listen, this is all about emotions. <laughs> it's literally what we were talking about right here with this King of Cups. This is about emotions. Feel those emotions. Walk away toward, uh, walk away from the past. Disappointments go towards the new thing. Okay, because this is, this is a beautiful new chapter in your life. So uh, this is set. This is yours for the taking. This is yours for the taking. Celebrate the moments now. You have your wish fulfillment. You have it. Just celebrate the little moments right now. Okay? Just celebrate them. Just heal from past wounds. Yeah. Here's temperance. Yeah. Step outside and go make things happen. Okay? Go to look. Two of wands at the bottom, uh, just below temperance. Go make this happen. Go make this happen, you guys. Whatever that looks like for you. I, I don't know what that is. But stop overly focusing on the one thing and go cel go celebrate the moments as, as they're happening. All right. We needed uh, outcome. Outcome. Did something flip? Yep. Hold on. Empress. Is that it? Nope. Okay. There's that hangman again. Oh my gosh. Look at temperance. Just like it was here in reverse. Stop overly focusing. Stop trying to, oh, I need to balance things out. Just freaking do it. It's right there. There's nothing more for you to do. Just do it. Just go. Just go. Ooh. You untie yourself from that restrictive place. You holding yourself right here, right? Stop. Oh, I need to balance. I need to figure this out. Stop doing that. You're able to just stand up and walk away and build something brand new. It's almost like you have to fertilize the ground that, that you're in. It's like, oh, you have to go towards it. It's there. It's there for the taking, but you have to fertilize that ground that's in front of you in order for the thing to build. But you can't fertilize that ground if you're too busy focusing on other things, or maybe you don't realize that you have to fertilize that ground because you're too focused on, oh, I have to balance, I have to do this, I have to do that, right? When really there's a beautiful synergy but it feels like you're a little in, in, in your head, like, oh, I need to make something work. But it doesn't feel like anything, you don't need to make anything work because it's set. It's there. It's there for you. There's nothing additional that you have to do. You just have to allow, really. And you have to release. Release that extra grip that you have on, on whatever. So as far as an outcome, if you let go, you're able to walk away from the things that bind you and hold you in. And you're able to work towards that new thing so that you have that continual garden and you don't, and you don't feel that overly obsessive feeling that you had that you had before or that overly um, hold that had you before. It just feels lighter here, joyous, like you're dancing and, and fun and free. Final message, powerful. May you be as potent as the ocean. It came out sideways. I'm going to read it sideways. What I'm getting here is that, remember that blend that I was talking about here, that emergence that's happening? There it is. 
whatever this is, this is a potent situation. You have all the capability. You have all of the power, but you have to allow the, the thoughts and heart or whatever those two things are to really merge together. And you have to allow the light to take out the, the dark. You know, the light to take out the dark. Maybe you had darker people around you, right? And you're like, oh, oh, and every time you started something, you had dark, um, like people with negative energy around you, right? The fool normally has a little white dog, right? Which is light. Allow, my beautiful ones, just allow. It's all there for you. It's all there, all right? My beautiful ones, I hope this did resonate. If it did, like, share, subscribe, and comment. Also stick around um, or like hit that subscribe button so that you're notified of the second half of the month. Until we meet again, bye.